Over the weekend, we saw temperatures in the northwestern Pennsylvania area reach a record high of 71 degrees, and then within hours just drop drastically to the lower 30s. These unusual changes may affect your health during the winter months. Star Bodie now with a look at ways you can keep your body healthy. Star. Jill, even though there's warmer temperatures in the forecast, you still may be susceptible to getting sick, but there are tips you can look out for to ensure you're staying healthy. Usual start to the new year. We've seen temperatures change frequently, which may give your body a break from getting sick when it's warmer outside. When you look at the flu virus, it likes cold, dry air. So the warm spells might actually give people a break as far as how easily the flu virus is going to spread. Erie County Department of Health has reported 279 cases for this year, including an increase in type B influenza. The unusual thing about flu season this year is not necessarily the number of cases, but the fact that we're having type B flu early in the season rather than type A. Type B influenza has been reported in younger people, which also includes less severe symptoms than type A. In Erie County, there's only been 14 hospitalizations, which is half the amount of the 2019 flu season. Breathing in cold air, that interferes with your normal innate immune response to germs that land in your nose. Colder air provides a simpler way for germs yeah. to enter your body, whereas warmer air may cause germs to diminish. There are some tips that you can take to be sure you're staying healthy during the cold winter months. You can prevent getting sick with the flu or a cold by staying home if you feel under the weather, washing your hands frequently, getting plenty of sleep, and staying hydrated. As always, if you have any symptoms of the cold or flu, it's important to see a doctor immediately. Sean. Thanks, Star.